Was ist los, meine Leute? Hope everyone's having a good day and night. Um, got some new subs in here, which is awesome. Welcome. Uh, this is my channel, obviously, and we focus on, well, not we, I, because I'm the only one involved, focus on, you know, budget-friendly rips, throw in a little bit of, I guess, trivia, a little, spread some knowledge here once in a while if I have any to give. Um, so, yep, pretty straight to the point, nothing fancy. Not going to blow you away with my ed editing skills, because I don't edit. I either get it right the first time, or I just don't post it at all. So, anyway, what we've got today is another blaster of uh, 2022 Tops Update. Of course, from Walgreens. They're always in stock. So I don't have to worry about that. I can rely on them. Um, I was hoping that those uh, three fat packs of 2022 um, Absolute Football would be here today, but they weren't. And I wanted to rip something and upload something today, so I went and got this. We've uh, we've been on the L train here for a while, so I need to pull something like that's worth at least a little bit. I mean, come on, I'm getting hosed here. I can't remember the last time. I mean, I can't remember, but it's been so far, and few and far between that I pull something good that. It's painful. I'll just leave it at that. So we got that. All right. We are accompanied with my friends um, Christian Leitner. This is specifically for my buddy who hates him, and I'm hoping he'll uh, come around and start watching my channel. And then we got our buddy LJ Hose, rookie card, one of my favorite players of all time. And of course, we've got Iverson, Smoltz. Chef Bagwell, and a grenade, just in case um, anyone wants to get blown up, including myself, which is more than likely what's going to happen. Just kidding, it's not a live grenade. Alright, so, you guys know the format, seven packs. One of them contains an exclusive commemorative relic card, which obviously is just a manufactured batting helmet quote-unquote relic. They are using the term relic extremely loosely there. Um, I did open one other thing today, and it was a pack, that fat pack of uh, Optic 20, 2021 Optic Baseball. This is exactly um, what I pulled. No cards out, no cards put in, and the exact collation. Nothing exciting, but here it is anyway if you're interested, because then I was hyping it up a little bit. Awesome looking cards, I really do, and I like their inserts too, they look great. Hinjin Ryu, Isaiah, Manny Machado, Tatis, Flaherty, got a Diamond Kings insert of Carlos Correa. His press conference was delayed today because of something involving his physical, so I don't know. Evan White rated rookie, Kirilov rated rookie, Tucker Davidson rated rookie, got a mythical of Yelich, this is a silver prism. I, I don't know an optic, I haven't opened enough to tell, but um, I'm not sure if these inserts, all these mythicals are silver or not. Uh, Trey Turner, um, green parallel, prism, Molina, and Alec Bohm rated rookie, prism, green parallel. Then got a Diamond Kings Marte, this is a prism. Okay, so I guess, yeah, like, all inserts aren't necessarily prisms, because this Diamond Kings is not a prism. And for those of you who are uh, new to the hobby, you can tell by, if not by looking at it, you'll see prism written right there. And on the other one, it will be blank. So, there are various spots on different cards, but pretty simple. And then... I haven't somehow have not seen these before, but a rated prospect of C.J. Abrams. Maybe I just wasn't paying attention, but I have not seen that rated prospect. Um, I guess logo. So that's kind of cool. It's clearly not part of the base set. The reason I say that is you can look at the number on the card. It's RP nine, so that stands for obviously rated prospect nine. So kind of cool. I'll have to look at that a little bit more. And then a Matt Olson um, T minus 
not a prism so yeah this was like maybe six bucks shipped off ebay and i want to get a couple of blasters of this i know people kind of kind of steer away from it because it is panini so they don't have the licensing but it doesn't bother me that much and they're just they're good looking cards and you can pull some bangers out of them so i think i'm gonna get a couple of blasters okay let's start with this one first of seven this is an extremely thin pack 14 cards for the pack. I would be shocked if 14 cards made it into this. Right, we'll see. Kenley Jansen, Marisnik, Woods rookie, Torinos, Martinez rookie, Stroman, Trevino, Cole, Sano, Cole Sands. I almost said Sanos. Well, I did say Sanos. Let me take that back. It's Sands. Austin Nola, brother of Aaron Nola, Felix Bautista rookie, Matt Olson. Garrett Stubbs, a Shohei All-Star Game, and Tim Anderson, Stars of the MLB. Okay. The, at Wal Walgreens, they also had a hanger of um, 2022 Series 2, and yeah, you guys know what I think about Series 2. Not much is what I think of it, so, well, at least nothing, not much that's positive. Just a little bit. So I didn't I didn't scoop that up. I'm gonna rip all this and wish that I had, but that's okay. I showed some restraint for once. Hey, there we go. MJ Melendez, um, base rookie. Man, look at these stats. I don't know if you guys have heard of him because he's kind of overshadowed by uh, Bobby Witt Jr. But in 123 games. Um, in 2021 alone between two teams, double uh, A AA and triple A, I believe. He uh, had 448 bats, 41 homers. 41. And an OPS of 1.011. 103 ribbies. This is crazy. This guy's got insane power for being relatively small at 190. So. Well done. That was a, I think that guy's this guy's gonna be one to watch out for. I don't care for that giant print line, but that's okay. Luke Jackson, Jose Cisnero. Whoa, that hold on. Are my eyes just <laughs> I that's never happened to me in with tops, at least. It's happened it happens all the time in those crappy uh, mystery boxes. Same card twice. Okay. The only thing I can think of is that this is just a complete error, or maybe I finally got an advanced stats. It's going to happen one day. I'm not going to stop ripping until I pull one on my own. I don't care if it's the worst player in the MLB. I mean, let's see. So the first one, no, not advanced stats. It would be numbered right here to 300 if it were. And no, just all right. Well, Thank God I'm a huge Jose, uh, what's his name, Cisnero fan. A little double dose there. Okay, this is a weird pack. Yeah, because the uh, stars of the MLB is always at the end, almost. Almost always at the end. And clearly here in the end, we have just a regular base, Kenley Jansen. So, I don't know what's going on with this pack. Francisco Morales, rookie. Steven Kwan, rookie based. Nice. Yeah, we got all the, in, and then random, I am very confused here. Let's make it all right in the world here. Tyler Wade, Garrett Stubbs, Matt Olson, Austin Nola, Cole Sands again, Jose Trevino again. This is some odd coalition here. Marcus Stroman, Trinos, Marisnik again, Jansen again. Well, not again, the Jansen I alluded to earlier. Christian Pache. I always pull this card and then Wonder what happened to his hat. Like, obviously it fell off, but... <laughs> like, I, I don't know. Like, at what part did it fall off? Because he didn't dive, obviously. Uh, we got a royal blue parallel of Connor Pilkington, a.k.a. Um, Carl, Carl Pil Pilkington. It's a royal blue parallel, obviously. Pretty cool, rookie. Pulled that in a whip. That was nice. Trevor Story, 35th. I'll put that in there. Got a Scherzer, Stars MLB, Luke Jackson, Josh Donaldson, another 
Scherzer, not the same one. And Tim Anderson stars in MLB again, and the same Shohei Otani. This is an odd box. I'm just going to put it that way. Next, this one feels pretty thick by comparison. Yoshi Tatsugo, Pepwa, I believe is how it's pronounced. I've been struggling with this one for a hot minute, which is embarrassing because I'm a Dodgers fan. But um, yeah, Pepwa. That seems to be the only pronunciation that is rational. Um, Villar, Darren Roof, Josh Lowe, rookie debut. AJ Pollock, Jesse Winker, Hunter Green, rookie debut. Nate Quinn, Kevin Smith, Gomez, Camilo Duvall. Got a Torkelson, rookie debut. And Mackenzie Gore, rookie, stars the MLB. All right, next pack. Yeah, three packs left. Okay, I can... This is one of those. I know, I, I can see just a sliver of the car in the back there, but I can tell that's a chrome star, stars of the MLB. Lucas Sims. Court... It's going to do that the entire time. Corey Dickerson. There we go. Jeremy Pena. Rookie debut. Chad Cool. Andrew Neiser. Kenzie Gore, rookie debut. I think he's still rated 10th in overall prospects. Might have dropped, I'm not sure. Michael Franco. Tyler Anderson. Alex Degatti. I already know who this is. Wait, hold on. No, I don't. It's either Hunter Green or Jonathan India. I think it's... It's India. Okay. Hunter Green. Is he even in these? I, I don't know if he's in the Stars MLB. Never mind. Maybe I take that back. Rookie of Alex Degatti. Here's the chrome. Buster Posey Paragons of the postseason. Bryce Harper. And then another Stars MLB, Saya Suzuki. These are such cool-looking cards. It's a shame they were just, just so overproduced. You get at least one in every pack. I think there are parallels of them. Fairly sure. I don't know if they're in retail or not. I'll have to look, but I'd like to get one of those. I mean, hell, I've ripped enough of these packs to figure out what I came across one by now. Colby Allard, Pujols, Kyle Isbell, Strickland, Hernandez. Oh, I got something orange back there. Cool. Let me get a J-Rod orange. Chris Bryant. So we do get a number card in this box, at least. Kikuchi. Kershaw, Gray, Bryce Elder rookie, Ottavino, Richie Palacios rookie, Brandon Marsh, stars the MLB. That guy, just every video I get that card. I don't know what it is. All right, we got an Astro. That's awesome. So what we want right here is we want to get that little rookie logo in the top right or the top left. Because that narrows it down to a possible Jeremy Pena. It's a rookie. And it's not Pena because that's clearly someone pitching. Damn it. We were so close. Joe Perez. And it is not um, someone pitching. It's shortstop or second baseman, I would imagine. Third baseman. Out of 299. I, I don't know much about this dude, but his minor league stats look good. Between Asheville, Fayetteville, and Corpus Christi, he had 18 homers, batting batted 291, OPS of 850, basically. It's not bad. I haven't looked at his um, MLB stats, but hey, he won a World Series if he was on that roster. I've heard the name, but don't know much about him. I'll take that. Obviously, we would have liked it to be um, liked it to have been Pena, but that's not bad. I don't think, at least. Okay. Let's put this over here. <clears throat> Lucius Fox. Chris Bassett. Bo Brisky, rookie. Boxberger. Azokar, rookie. Grinky, future Hall of Famer. Jace Peterson. Jorge Soler. Bobby Wood Jr. There we go. Very nice. 
Not the rookie debut either. That's the one we want right here. Print line city. I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but let's see if it, yeah. Look where that look where the light is refracting. Just a huge print line. That is a shame. Paddock, Nick Allen. Ooh. Wait, no, this is just a rainbow. Never mind. I got excited for nothing. Not numbered. Rainbow foil parallel. Those are one in every one in ten. The uh, royal blue is every one in ten as well. Gold this year is one in fourteen, which is strange. But I feel like I, I get a. I mean, I know the odds are a little bit favored to get a, a rainbow foil or royal blue, but I get those like significantly more than the golds. And if I do get a gold, half the time it's like a team card that no one wants. Okay, I know I talk about this every time. Um, but, so, commemorative batting helmet card parallels. That's manufactured, that's guaranteed in every blaster. There's blue, black, gold, red, platinum, and auto. Blue is 1 in 82, giving us our best chance. And an auto is 1 in 5,674, which is the second least likely behind platinum which is one in 50,000 essentially so wowza and let's look real quick for I don't think those even yeah they wouldn't even put those on here oh, wait stars of the MLB yep there are parallels but they are pretty rare the chrome one in ten it's your best shot at getting anything related to that um, ba -ba. red, black, platinum. Anyway, I don't know. Maybe one day. McCutcheon and Julio. Okay. After this video is done, I'm not going to subject you guys to it, but I will go through and see if we got any advanced stats. Well, hell, it's only an extra minute. You can turn it off at this pack if you want, if you haven't already. <laughs> Here's Familia, Joe, Dunnand. I have trouble distinguishing the D's from the O's in this typeface. That's a fancy word for font. I learned it from an ex-girlfriend who was into graphic design, so now I feel all smart, even though I still don't really know what the difference is. Wysiga, rookie, Krizin, Joey Wentz, rookie. Wonder if he's related to Carson once. Well, he's from Kansas. See, Carson once is not from Kansas. I don't know why I even said that. Luplo, Brad Hand, Trevor Story, Matt Beatty, Brandon Marsh. Uh, I think we got a. All right, let me guess here. A black, gold. In the back there, it looks like it. Brandon Marsh. God, get out of here, dude. Urias Anderson. Yep. Alright, I saw it said Seattle. Um just be Julio. Come on. Alright, I don't want to ruin it. Kyle Tucker. Stars MLB. Alright, come on. Big money. Wait. That's a blue jay. Okay. Mmm. Maybe it didn't say Seattle. That's that's Bo Bichette. I can pretty much it. Yep. Sweet. I like Bo Bichette. He's one of my favorite players. And then Tim Anderson, commemorative, which I already have. Not numbered or anything, but oh, I saw it. Wow. I took a Bichette as Seattle, the end there. Thought that was an L. Anywho, uh, that is about it. I'm going to look on the back of these. This is out of 299, of course. Cool. So those are those are the three big ones. As recap, everything else is pretty much expendable. Um, tops. I could probably put together the set by now, to be honest. Uh, Black gold Bichette, Bobby Witt, um, base rookie card, the desirable rookie card of his, featuring that massive print line, and then a Joe Perez um, orange parallel rookie out of 299. So not too bad. I've had worse boxes, I'll tell you that. All right.
let's put these so get these in order here or maybe not let's see okay and check these I'll try to stay organized so I don't have to do it later I figure if I just do it now let's look for those advanced stats come on just give me one Do, do. Not looking good in this pile, which makes sense because most of these are rookie cards. Actually, let's put that Melendez over there. Most of these are rookie cards. They wouldn't have any stats to advance, I guess, for the lack of a better term. So basically, I think all the advanced stats cards are going to be limited to just base veterans if that makes sense so this guy like potentially it's not a rookie it's not a team card it's not an insert it's not um one of the like the milestone cards any of that so that's your only bet it's not a 35th anniversary i think you guys get the point no It'll happen one day. Anything worth having doesn't come easy. How true that is. I don't like it, but that's true. I want instant gratification at all times. That's how the world should be. Just kidding. Well, wasn't in that blaster. That's all right. Anywho, that's my video. Um, hopefully those three fatties of uh, 2022 football absolute comes tomorrow. Um, not much else in the pipeline beside that. Um, just preparing for Christmas. Might uh, go pick up a, another blaster tomorrow or something to rip. If those cards don't show, but I don't know. We'll play it by ear. Alright guys, hope you have a good night.